We are gathered here today as Ministers of Finance to look into the implementation of what we refer to as the common extended tariff, meaning goods coming into Liberia, Guinea, and Sierra Leone. Our input duty is the same. If they are not the same, we want to bring them together. That is what we call harmonized input tariff to make sure that there is free movement of goods and services within the region to benefit our people. It is going to create what we call a large market, improving domestic production of goods and services, so also to also protect our firms against goods coming from outside of the ECOWAS region. So in a way, the more we can produce within the ECOWAS region, it creates job opportunities for our people. So it is in this context that we're talking about the regional integration. So that's why we have come today to look at what are the challenges? What progress have we made? In the process of going forward with the CET implementation, are there challenges? How do we address them? So it is in this context that we are here to look at all of the issues in the implementation of the CET.